over there. It is great to see you again. Welcome. And you're here for your ear cleaning. And I'll say slash examination there as well as I'm sure that I'll be examinating, just making sure that everything is nice and clean and perfect for you there too. That's great. And before we begin, just allow me to do something there for you. Okay, just come in on your left ear there. Okay. Okay. Right. And then again there. And we're just going to come on your right ear there. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Don't worry, we'll get back to that. So, you were booked in today for your ear cleaning. Don't worry that everything is logged up here. And what you wanted done, so you said you, that you had a little bit of an earwax build up. Okay, no, that's, that's perfect. That's what this whole system's here for, is for you to write anything that you want to come in here for, any information that you think will be useful to me then it's great for me to read um, and prepare everything, make sure I've got all the tools ready here for you as well, so everything's done efficiently for you. So you, there's an earwax builder. Okay, anything substantial? Do you feel full blockage? Um, do you feel like it's when you move or do lie in certain positions? Is there anything different about your hearing? No, that's great. Okay, so that would be uh, quite a large blockage there and build up an earwax, but that's not the case. What I probably suspect it's it's a moderate or just a slight earwax build up. Okay, do you listen to headphones, ear plug headphones? Yeah. In this modern age it's it's quite hard not to, isn't it? This can be a common occurrence uh, with our ears, our ears tend to build up a little bit more earwax when you listen to headphones on a regular basis there as well. So this can lead to a slight earwax build up, which can sometimes, but not all the time, you feel a slight difference or hear a slight difference you know, in, in sound and it might be just a little bit tempered, but just the, the slightest amount. Okay then, so you obviously know who I am, of course Dr. Fred, and of course it is great to see you again. And last time you came in I think that I wasn't here, was I? My sincerest apologies for that, of course I want to make sure I'm always here for my patients, but you know sometimes that I have to be uh, away for various things, so yeah, I think you saw Dr. Lightspeed here. He, usually takes over for me. And there's also, you came and see uh, Dr. Henry Charles Reginald III. Yeah. Okay, and he's also been at this establishment. Okay, and these are just a couple of practicing doctors we have here. So if I'm never in here, those two usually come to me. So I hope that everything was great for you there. That's what we liked here. Okay. So for your ear examination, there's a couple of things what I'll do. We'll begin with the examination, then we'll do the cleaning. I think it's probably prudent just to have a quick look and see what we're dealing with here, see how much the earwax has built up, if there's a substantial amount or not. I can probably say the latter there. And then we will begin with the cleaning. So if you had an earwax cleaning before, pretty sure that I've given you one. Yeah, I hardly remember. Okay, so you've had it before, but this time we're actually removing the earwax, uh, which has built up over a little bit of time, which of course is what I recommend doing. And you did right by coming to see me and getting that done. So the extraction is is very minimal, I'm sure, and what you would probably feel is just that feeling in between uh, scratching and tickling. And at no point this should hurt you at all, you should you feel uncomfortable during it. And this is quite a relaxing process, what we'll do is just dip the lights down a little bit, and then 
hopefully you feel it and not to go kind of imagine what's going on it's literally me going generally in your ear canal extracting just a little bit generally in your other ear canal extracting just a little bit taking the utmost care and then looking into your ears making sure it's fully clear then we're done so you should be living with a nice smile on your face satisfied at hearing it just slightly better okay so let me show you the tools that we're going to be using so you're probably very familiar with this in the case so i'll be looking through here attachment at the end so you'll be feeling this on your in your ear a little bit there just be a little bit but the smallest amount of pressure applied but nothing you would barely feel whatsoever okay and then i'll be using the light on this just to light up in your ear canal this will be magnified and i will check both respected is there okay and i'll do that before and after the earwax removal of course you know what these are don't you yeah these are to make sure that everything is all sanitary and everything's going to be clear for you so when i'm working around your ears and holding your ear I'll be wearing like this gloss there as well, so you will be feeling that and uh, comforted, comforted to know that everything is nice and sanitary for you for that as well. Also, when we do this, I've just washed my blazer as well on my jacket, so this is just, it's not very serious, it's just when I do anything, I'd like to make sure that you know and all my patients know that everything is nice and clean. This is freshly washed and I only change it through each patient should I need to use it as well. So this is just a jacket that I will put over. Okay. And so there's that. So the tools which I'll be using here are what I'll be putting into your ear. So these are just the tiny extraction tools and I have a little scoop there at the end. Okay. Then we have this here. This is a little feather feeling thing here. This will feel really good, I'm sure, but it serves a purpose. We're getting those sort of dusty earwax bits. Okay. Then we have and I'll get a new one there for you as well. Cotton swaps there. So these will just be the final bits to make sure our work is clean and tidy there for you. Okay. I have various other extraction tools. If it's a little bit too cold for you, you can just switch to the plastic versions there. So that would be nice and comfortable for you there as well. And just different variations in sizes there too. My main tool, it works as an autoscope. But what this is as well, this will have a wireless connection. There's a camera on the end here. So during your cleaning, what I'll do is at some point I'll pop it up on the big screen. Okay, can you see yourself there? Okay, and you will enlarge down your ear canal and make sure that all earwax is collected. During that process, this has multifunctions. I have a connection here. This it lights up the way, but also is screwed on there so that won't come off and then there's a rubber bit on the end here and this rubbery bit will feel really nice as we take out those little bits of earwax there too and those will be all the tools that we will need to use for your earwax removal there's literally nothing complicated about this whatsoever all that's really required for you is just literally relax enjoy yourself some people will see it's a bit of a timeout and they just switch off completely so if you want to do the same you can i'll gently guide you what through what i'm doing and it, there will be nothing to worry about basically if you feel anything anything comes uncomfortable uh, just let me know you shouldn't feel any discomfort during an ear examination or earwax removal just a little bit of different feelings shall I say with the extraction and then of course satisfaction when it's all out 
and uh, if some people who actually get large earwax buildups and they have the full extraction then it's uh, you they will notice a little, quite a substantial difference there um, but i don't think that's going to be the case for you as it wasn't too long since you got your last ear examination and i did i did a little extraction there didn't i just cleaned it a little bit yeah that wasn't too long ago so like i said i always recommend you coming in and uh, just keep it on top of it just checking out your health making sure it's good and i'm of course exceptionally happy to to do all this for you as well i we want to make sure that you can hear perfectly and you're in fine pristine health okay so what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna take my jacket off for now and pop on my coat there and we shall begin excellent excellent so all that's required from me just before we begin is to use the autoscope just to check to see how much earwax is there okay we will gloves here as well and get you the fully seen too that's one it's quicker than you expected okay so pop in this one as well right so water scoop now I'm just gonna come in very close here and take a good look in both of your ears all right so you're all comfortable you will just feel a little bit here but that's literally nothing okay yeah so i can see just a little bit of earwax build up here there's nothing drastic in there, but I can see it's just a little bit. Would be a little bit out of reach in there. So on your left ear, there's just a little bit of earwax in there, which I can easily extract and clean there for you. So sometimes with a little bit of earwax build up, it might feel like you can't hear as well as you normally do. So with all those um, earwax bits gone, you will feel really good. Again, I'll just check. a little bit of the uh, earwax built up on that side there as well but it's literally it's nothing to be worried about at all there so i'll just have a quick check of that there too just on the outside whilst we yeah.
this earwax build up on the left ear and a little bit on the right ear as well. So those, because they're a little bit deep, I assume is why uh, you've been struggling to, to clean them. It's just because they're a little bit further back and you've done right to come see me and let me get that all cleaned up there for you as well. So everything felt fine for you to do? No, nothing hurts at any point whatsoever. If anything becomes uncomfortable for you, then you just let me know. I'll stop and, you know, we'll go from there. Um, this shouldn't hurt you at all whatsoever. So we'll just check your ears. Well, we'll just check your ears. So we'll just start to clean your ears now. Uh, there won't be any water applied there. It's just a classic cleaning method that we'll be using. So you just feel relaxed and allow me to get to work and I'll do the best job I possibly can and get that all removed for you. And I promise you it will be be feeling and sounding all great for you very shortly. Is there anything I could get you? Would you like some water or something? Well, if you need anything, please let me know. So what we we'll do, we'll just turn the lights down a little bit there. So you're just a little bit more relaxed. Just getting that bit. 
it out there. And that's the big one. How do you feel? Full feel good. Great. Like I said, that's your full water difference when you get that earwax out. It's very satisfying. Feels good for you. Good. Right. And just a little bit in there, which I can take out. And apart from that, it is. That's it for your left ear. Cleaning just a little bit around the edge there. I'll just take this swap there and just get any residual bits that's still in your ear. Okay, just around there. A little bit around there. It's basically just all the bits around your ear as well. It's not just the way it
really want it. So left here is all clear there. And just save those pictures. Great. So it's going to be the same for your writers. Everything feel good for you. Nothing feel uncomfortable. That's what we like to hear. And I think you look pretty relaxed there. That's great. That's the best way to be. It's quite a relaxing process, really, and it is satisfying. Okay, so I'm going to start work on your right here. Just one bit more there. Just be a little bit stubborn. this in your ear again. Okay, take that bit off. And I'm going to put it up on the big screen and have a look. And just to make sure that we've got all those bits of earwax there for you. Okay, so I'm going to place that in there. 
like that's comfortable for you. Great. Let me know if it comes uncomfortable at all. Okay, yeah, that's all clear. Did a good job there, so we made that a little bit. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's where the earwax was. All good still. Great. Zoom in a little bit there. That's good. That's good as well. You still good? Great. And perfect. Just taking it out there. Brilliant. That sound. I'm um, pleased to hear it. It's just a little test, which I do with patients just to make sure they notice a little bit of a difference once they've had the yeah, wax removal and extraction. So it's a good sign that you can hear just a little bit better now. Like you call earwax, was, it was quite minimal, so you really shouldn't hear substantial difference, only just a little bit, and it should feel more comfortable for you as well. You might have that little bit of feeling after you come out from a uh, massage, you just feel that relaxation, but also it's been very attentive for your ears, so I hope that's been, that it's come across, and you, you feel like everything's healthier in there for you as well. And of course, it is a healthier thing to do here as well, to get that earwax removed, because of course we don't want any build up or bacteria which could lead on to infection or anything like that. If earwax is in there, it could be in there for a long period of time, and you don't want it to affect uh, your hearing there as well. And the longer the earwax stays in there, then of course it collects more, builds up more, so it's always a good to just get it now and again, just come in, get it cleaned, I can do it for you nice and easily and uh, make it a relaxing process for you and hopefully you are now feeling better, healthier, happier and here a little bit better too. So was there any questions you would like to ask me about it? And so both of your ears, they feel nice and clean, that you're satisfied with the whole experience great. Oh, I'm really happy to hear that. It's, it's the pleasure, always is a pleasure for me 
to help you. I'm your doctor, Dr. Fred. You are my patient and you are my main priority. Okay, so don't ever feel like you're burdening me with anything because you're not. Uh, it's anything that you want, just let us know here at the surgery. You pop it in, anything you need seen to, and then we'll get it seen to. And we'll look after you and make sure that you're always in the fine bit of health and everything works and looks and feels great for you in there as well. Okay, so I'm just updating there both the earwax uh, has been removed on both your ears. That's great. And final thing, updating the lock. So everything that you've come in to see me in the past, everything is blocked on the system. So you've come in here for critical nerve examinations. If you want to check all that, go back to that then when you visited me, you can do all of that. The eye examinations, also the hearing test there as well. It's all here, so anytime that you want to go back to it, of course, you can check up. Feel free to do that. All the appointments we've had, um, it's quite satisfying just to go through them all and just to know what you've uh, had done. And anything you feel like you want done, by all means, get it booked in. We'll get you seen too. That's great. Well, once again, my pleasure. I really hope that uh, it feels good in there for you. Great. Was there anything else I can help you with or do anything for you there? That's great. Any questions? No worries. Well, it really was great to see you again. Hope you are feeling great and you're nice and relaxed too. Take care as well. Cheers.